you are doing this dance uh, that's been going on for four years now. Is it getting harder to do the dance without, as Beckett said, doing the deed as you're <laughs> oh, deed. doing the deed before taking the dive, I think is what you had said. Oh, wow. Mm. Is it getting hard who, who, to, to who flirt? Well, to Andrew and to, and to you guys. Yeah, let's go with Andrew, because he's the brains. <laughs> it's, it, it's not hard for me. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, I, I, I think in any, uh, in, in any story you're telling, uh, the characters organically suggest where they want to go. Um, and we've been watching these guys and watching their relationship evolve. Um, I think the challenge for us in, in, in the, the writer's wing is to find reasons for these guys not to be together and uh, struggle with when they should be together. Because I've always talked about this as a, as a, a sweeping love story. And uh, I'm somebody who feels like there will come a moment where the two of them do get together and that there's plenty of storytelling after that. Um, so we just want to be true to who the characters are and make sure that any obstacles that get in the way, that we aren't repeating ourselves, they're natural obstacles, they're organic obstacles, um, we all know those people who have been in, in um, this kind of dance for a while and looking as outsiders, we're like, don't you guys see that you're perfect for each other? But life, circumstance, other relationships, their own issues get in the way. Um, so as, as long as we feel like we can credibly do that with these characters, we feel very comfortable. And there'll come a time where we don't feel like uh, we can credibly keep these guys apart because look, you know, it's, it's 2012. Uh, people fall into bed. Uh, uh, yeah, they do. In, yeah, they do. In and out all the time. Day. So you know. Every day. But we we also know that we have to honor the reality of who these guys are. Nathan Stun, are you ready for the moment to happen? Yes. Yes. <laughs> I think it's played out very well. I think, uh, I think it's been very uh, tastefully and artfully uh, dealt with as far as the dance that we're talking right. about. Uh, but it's, I don't think it's something that can be done forever. But uh, Andrew has shared our, our, his plan. <laughs> mm. And uh, it's deft. It's nice. <laughs> and it's death. <laughs> when the time does come, whether it's yes. this year, next year, in two years, what? What would you like? No, no, not, not in two years. What have you heard? <laughs> Nothing. You know? What, what you would know? you like to have be in that scene? What should be part of it, part of the moment? Kissing. Lots kissing, of okay. Thumbs up on the kissing. Yeah, I always thought it should be really clumsy. <laughs> like stuff getting knocked over. Ow, ow, you're hurting my, sorry, sorry, let me get my, oh, that's, oh my back is on it. Oh, I can't move it there. Yeah. I remember Moonlighting did that actually when, when Dave and Maddie finally, remember that? You hated that? They, I think they you said destroyed a dirty word. the whole apartment. Will, you said a dirty yeah, word. Yeah, that's like saying Scott yeah. Scottish yeah. Like, <laughs> The M word, the M word. Um, well, Andrew, uh, do you know when it's going to happen? Yeah. You do? Okay. <laughs> Tell us. Uh, uh, no. Okay. <laughs> Well, when you do decide to pull that trigger, so to speak, what will that open up for you? What will they be able to do once <laughs> you've, you've gone in that territory that you can't do now? It's a good turn. <laughs> Pop. <laughs> uh, you know, I, I think when that time comes, um, it, it opens up new opportunities in the storytelling because when characters are in a relationship, they fundamentally act differently and they get on each other's nerves in different ways. Right. And there's fun in different ways. Uh, so, um, you know, I'm, I'm not saying necessarily that if and when they're together, Beckett and Castle can go on a princess cruise and solve a crime. <laughs> <laughs> but having them, <laughs> having them on the other side of that, uh, on, on the other side of that, it does open up possibilities, but it also opens up um, when it does happen, I, I think a, a next evolution in their relationship that can be just as fun. Um, so I'm somebody who doesn't believe that you wait until the end of the series. I'm not somebody who's ever believed in, in the curse of moonlighting in terms of them getting together. Yeah.